guys, this is Nick Brown from Gate Tech. Today, and today we're going to be pulling an EUI injector from the Cat 3406E. As you can see, we're on one of our overhaul, um, engine overhaul trainers. Alright, and so far I've got the valve cover removed as well, because I've also got the big brake assembly removed and also I've got the rock bar removed. To get to this injector, you have to get you have to remove those components. Alright, so with that we're gonna be continuing with this procedure. Next part of the procedure is going to take a 9 16 wrench or socket wrench or you can somehow use an offset wrench on this and also we're going to be using a heel bar. Okay, I'll show you what the heel bar is once I get done uh, undoing this bolt. Alright, take your 9 16 and loosen your injector nut, injector bolt on the injector heel. Now, at this point, Caterpillar said to pry up on this injector on the solenoid, the electronic solenoid side. Okay, so we're going to be doing that as Cat says. Alright, I'm going to be getting up, up, up here. Alright, I want to get up on, I want to get the heel bar up under there, and I want to pull back on it. You see how the injector just moved? All right, see how I can move it back and forth? All right. Alright, now I got the injector pried up, put off the side of your heel bar, alright, and then you can pull the injector by hand. Alright, the injector heel just came out with it, and this is how it goes back together. Alright, so now we've been, we pulled our injector, you can either replace the injector, or you can rebuild the seals on the EUI injector. Um, pretty much at this point, any R&R uh, &R on the injector at this point, alright, you can inspect the injector cup down into the cylinder to make sure for cracks. Um, you can uh, check it with a white light. Um, so pretty much at this point, you can do anything. All right, I'm gonna go and set it on the table. All right, um, so at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna install it for you guys. Now just remember with the injector heel, the slot, I don't know if you guys can see this, I'm in an awkward position right now. Um, the slot, it slides right in here on the center of the injector right below the spring. All right, with two hands, place uh, gently, if this is a new injector, you want to be very careful to not nick anything. Alright, place the injector back down into the slot. Alright. Now, you do not have to use the heel bar at this point. But you do insert the bolt, the injector bolt back in. Alright, finger tightening that first. Cat says to torque these to 34 to 48 foot pounds. Um, so just make sure you're not using the extension, or else, um, well, actually, with the extension, you're going to be uh, under torquing it, okay? You want to torque these to spec. Alright. All right, as I tighten it, I want to stop, okay? As far as, um, I don't have a torque wrench with me, but we're just gonna go ahead and we're gonna put everything back together. Um, so, so I'm gonna grab your rocker arm assembly. Now Kyle, you're gonna have to help me out with this. lift one side of up. You're gonna have to sort of kind of just play with it just to make sure everything is aligned. Make sure all your um, 
Make sure your injector rocker is aligned. Make sure your intake rocker is aligned. Your exhaust valve lock rocker is aligned. Okay, you're just basically just gonna have to play with it, but it does go into position. All right, so at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna set my Jake brake back in. Once you set this Jake brake back in, um, all the bolts just go back together. It's very simple. Cat made it very simple whenever they engineer this engine. Thank you, Cat. All right, it goes back together just like that. So with that, guys, that's basically how to remove an injector from a CAT 3406E, um, an EUI injector. So with that, guys, see you guys later.